morning. Good morning. You don't mind me being here a little early, do you? Oh, I'm, I'm totally ready for you. Oh, great. My name. How's everything going? It's going. It's going? Yeah, it's Friday, so it's going. Come on, you gotta be happier than that. Yeah, no, I'm happy. Oh, good. That's it. bad water. Uh, yeah. I think it's kind of minor. What do you mean? You mean the valve? Yeah, I don't know. The faucet? Yeah. All right. In other words, it could be worse, right? It could be, yeah. No, we had water over here yesterday, and they, they told me that it's, I just needed a new sink thing. So that's what they told me. That was their diagnosis. How much did they charge you to come out? There's no charge for rotor rotor. Oh, okay. But to put a new faucet in, I think they said 500. 500 bucks to put that in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I shot. Jeez, I'll give you, a, I'll take, uh, I'll do it for 450. Save you right, so much. Right, right. Hey, um, I have my own web channel on okay, YouTube, cool. so I'm going to be recording this. Is that okay with you? Oh, yeah, you? that's cool. That's cool. Uh, those are rags down there. For, for I'll use. pay extra if you talk dirty to me. <laughs> I make it able, interesting. I may be able to uh, uh, put that in. <laughs> there, there was that little bucket that I used. I tried to, I YouTubed it and tried to clean out the lines and it didn't work. So I gave it my best effort. I could Is your it. sink stopped up? No, I don't think so, no. Okay, all no, right. It's not. Let's Low see. water pressure and uh, I undid both those lines of cold and the hot like yeah. YouTube told me to do. Wow. And it did nothing work. Watch out for them guys on YouTube. I know, but I like to, you know, one time my washer broke and I fixed it. Wow. It wasn't anything major, it was just a hose that should have been in a different area. But, yeah. You know, I like to give it my effort. There you I'm, go. I'm a stubborn Pollock, as my husband says. You're a Pollock? I'm a stubborn Pollock. I like to try first Why? and then move on. Why don't you have power under there at that outlet? What do you mean? Does your disposal work? Yeah, I, I unplugged it. I unplugged okay, it. Okay, so my light is crapped out on me. Okay. All right, man. Man, I get a lot of Polish people calling me. <laughs> I don't know. I like to think I'm a hands-on person. I'm not that. No, I get fixed stuff. I'll tell you what, my last Polish lady I worked for, I think she's hands-on too. Yeah, I mean, she you told me if it works, if it doesn't, it doesn't, period. No, she told me, she said, if you, uh, if you ever need a little re relaxation, come on back. I was like, oh, what? You're like my kind of client. That's, I was like, I'll be back tomorrow. I always need some relaxation. <laughs> That's funny. Whoa. Now you're retired, right? Semi. Oh, okay. I only work part time. Okay, good. Good for you. Yeah, I've uh, done work myself to death almost. Yeah, that's how I fell off the lawyers up until I was 64. Oh, I wow. Retire when I turned 64. What did you do? I worked for, for lawyers. Oh, cool. Here, Mm hmm. You know, I would sue you. You would sue me? I could sue you if I wanted to. Or oh, well, let me just uh, get my shit together and get out of here. <laughs> but when I moved to Florida, I ended up in real estate. You know, all by Where are you from? Cleveland. Cleveland, you got a little bit of an attitude with Cleveland, huh? You, that's well, you why know, I like the, that. We're with the Browns. I have no choice. If you get the Cleveland Browns, you get hardened. Yeah, yeah. You guys are diehard fans, man. We have uh, Indians, right? Yeah. They're not even called the Indians anymore. Yeah. I don't even know half the damn teams. You got a little half sec on too. Yeah, I'm from Rhode Island. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm a Yankee. I've been here for 35 years, though. Right. So. Oh, that's good. We've been here for about seven. Thank God. We bought our house for Yankee. We run it for the six months. Thank God we bought this house right now. It's probably worth twice what you paid for it seven years ago. Well, not twice, but. I just feel sorry for my sons because, you know, how they going to buy it. Well, you know what? Let me tell you something. <laughs> if we've learned anything in this country over the, it, over my lifetime, uh, this too shall pass. Yeah, that's right. You know what I mean? It's nothing's ever stays the same. Christ, yeah. it's like a casino in this country. Right. Crazy. 
All right. Let me... Yeah, I'm good. Thanks. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Cash is fine. <sighs> What's that? Oh, it's gorgeous. Cannot beat it. a lot brighter under here without my sunglasses on. These are brand new, basically the supply hoses. So I don't need to replace them. Is that any dated on the retention? No. Well, uh, I did go in the in the plumbing. I started plumbing when I got out of the Navy. And uh, I decided at that point that, you know, that's that's what I was gonna do. I wasn't gonna bounce around doing a bunch of stuff, so it worked out good for me. He's a, he's, he was a Marine, I saw that. I just have this sense. It's the Navy, you know? Yeah, he, he was a, in the Department of the Navy, too. The Marines are in the Department of Navy. They call it the Men's Department. Really? Yeah, it's a joke. That's the... Nobody really laughs at my jokes, but... Um, yeah, that was the old joke in the Navy. That's what the Marines would say. Yeah, we're, we're the Men's Department. It's... Uh, now you said it wrong, you're not supposed to say he was a Marine. What's that? You said it wrong, you're not supposed to say he was a Marine. Oh, he is a Marine for life. My my brother's a Marine. Yeah. My brother's 80 years old and he's a Marine and he'll let you know. He was a recon. You know, those are the crazy guys. Those are the guys they dump off, they throw out of a plane over the enemy territory. Yeah, he was, uh... I enjoy being in the surface. It's uh, you know, wow. oh shit, what the hell is in there? And I just got my eye. Oh, are you okay? Yeah, that jar has. Oh, I tried to clear it out as much as I could. Yeah, but this thing didn't have a lid on it, and it just oh. fell on my face. <laughs> oh shit! Here, let me get you. Let me get you something here. Oh my! Did I kill me? Oh my god. You set me up. Holy shit, what is that stuff? Plant food? Oh, that's good. My eyes are bad anyways. Maybe they'll get better. I'm so sorry. I have eye drops and everything if you want. Holy shit, miracle, oh, bro. Oh god. 
to look like that little miracle glory. Hey, they're getting my hair too. It's getting a little thin. Oh, jeez, maybe I'll make you grunt. I've heard of chicken shit, but not plant, you know, plant oh. food. Thank you, ma'am. I hope you're okay. I'm fine. I have a lot of issues. You're hard, huh? Yeah, I've been beat up. Take a little bit of miracle grow in the eyeball. That's a first, I gotta tell you that. Especially with the lid not on it. Nothing like a little miracle grow in the eyeball to take the wind out of your sails.
Yeah. Yeah. You know, five bucks to advertise. You can't beat it. Really. Five dollars for a whole month. it off Vista. Who'd you call? It was a hairline pipe. <clears throat> we got called Terry's plumbing only because our neighbor gave us his car. You know what? We I did a lot of repipes in this area on this street, Terry, Terry Lane, or whatever it is. Uh, Terry's a good friend of mine. Yeah. He's a really good friend. He's like a brother to me. Well, I don't know if this guy was Terry that came no. out. No. Super, super cool. Yeah, Terry's and Luckily, not. it was like inside the wall. Uh huh. So, but there's a panel on my bathroom that. Um, but you know, you come on a Saturday night at 6.30, they're like double the cost. 
So you've had a lot of plumbers here in the last week. Wow. Chris, you've had uh, Roto Rooter, Terry's, and me. Yeah, you're right. Well, I hope the next time you need a plumber, you call me back. Well, I got you my contacts. There you go. Oh, yeah. That works for me. I'm not out to get rich, you know. I mean, I'd like to live comfortably, but I, I treat people the way I want to be treated. And, uh, that's what I do. I mean, I'm done. I'm, I'm off the treadmill. Running a business will run you down. And uh, if you're not careful. Okay. Let's go upstairs again. a little tech tip on putting these spray escutcheons on uh, put the put the hose in and pull on that to hold it you know in place while you tighten it up took me 25 years to figure that out Get it centered over the hole as best you can and then pull down on it. Yeah. Tighten her up. Get this guy centered as best you can. But they wanted to charge you for that faucet. Did that include a faucet? Uh, I don't think it did. Wow. No, actually, it did. Well, it had no shame. Huh? Um, and if you did that, it was going to be 800. Jesus Christ, man. You boys have no shame. No, they don't. They're just like highway robbery, man. Like you need to fill out a police report after they come to your house I don't know man well they'd sleep at night to be honest right. they probably sleep in their nice house <laughs> sleeping very well yeah they set the policy and the pricing Thank you. 
Well, it's been a few years now, but yeah, I, I had gone up a couple summers, maybe three, four years ago. I went up uh, two summers in a row. I had a camper, and uh, it was nice, you know. I get to spend time with one of my, my oldest sister, and unfortunately, and I, I've been here for 35 years, so uh, I didn't really see her much over that time, but... I was able to spend two summers at her house in my camper and uh, unfortunately she passed away this year yeah so I feel like that was a that was a blessing you know. I'm not sure what we got here maybe that's just a cap that I just put on Yeah, that's a that's a cap, man, in case you don't want to use the spray. Oh, pay attention. Basically have every scenario covered when you buy stuff from like see that? That's it. Alright. I'm gonna reuse your supply hoses because they look brand new. See this house has been repiped with with PVC PVC. You need that on a ice maker line. It's already getting better. That fucking miracle grow works pretty good, guys. Just don't try that at home. Yeah. I will tell you guys when you're working around this CPVC. Especially like this looks like it may have been repiped 10, 15 years ago. Uh, this shit is very brittle. So back your stuff up. 
Don't put any more pressure than you need to on it. I'm gonna open these. Just a tad. Don't don't use it all up, guys. Oh, that's, somebody already did. Yeah. When you tighten the packing nut up, just tweak it a little bit. Don't crank it down so that the next guy has nothing to work with. meet you. I guess you were in the Navy? Yes, I was. I guess just to sign my checks. <laughs> yeah, I told your wife, you guys were in the, in the Department of Navy, too. Oh, yeah. The, men, the, the men's department. The, the men's department? <laughs> That's what they called it, yeah. I know I mean, you guys didn't like, you, you guys didn't like us on your boats, I remember that. Yeah, they, uh. When were you in? I went in in 1985. Okay, I was in from 73 to 77. Uh -huh. Everything looked pretty good down there? Yeah, well, Besides needing to be replaced, yeah, it wasn't that bad. Um, it was just time. Yeah. What what uh, what years were you in? Seventy three to seventy seven. Oh wow. So I was on a I was on an LPH for a while. Uh huh. I was on a supply ship. Supply ship. Yeah. We did uh, underway replenishments. Uh, ammunition. Fueling, ammunition, you know. Yeah. It was full of bombs. My ship's name was USS Nitro. Really? Yeah, if that don't make you sleep good at yeah. night. Hey, Bob, I'm going to loosen this valve up just a tad. And if you could push it back, because it's not covering, you'll see how it's not covering that. Where are you, buddy? Oh, break a break one nine. Yeah, this is gonna turn wide of the base, and it's outside. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, I'll take a peek at it, but you getting water coming out from underneath it? Always take these off, guys. You don't want to inject a bunch of uh, crap into the faucet immediately. The other thing you don't want to do is move it down the drain. 
which I almost did. Faucet. That's the diverter in here. diverter in it that diverts, you know, it shuts the water off to the spout. Let me show you this. When you run in the faucet, and then when you divert it to this, hear that knocking? That's inside this valve, so it's normal. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about it. Can it change the spray, or just does it have to be like that spray? No, not that. No, thing. you mean the pattern? No, this one. Can it just come out regular? Maybe. Mm, no, that's it. I like the spray. I don't. Let's see. Maybe it has. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty slick. Yeah, that's like that. Oh, I didn't even realize that. Oh, okay, so it's like a choice. Nice. Let's see, maybe it doesn't make that noise under this. I didn't realize that that's what that was. And now it's not making any noise anymore either. So okay. yeah. I learned something. You taught me something today. <laughs> Thank you. Put it on YouTube, would you? I, it's going to be on YouTube. Uh, <laughs> uh, Is that one for the uh, disposal? Yeah, I'll plug that in. Okay. All right, so you're all set. That's great. That's a nice th feature. I didn't yeah. realize that. I mean, you can get it for two fifty. I don't want anything there. No, yeah. hundred dollar valve. What yeah, the hell? Cool, I mean, you know what? They're not the way they are these days. It's like a throwaway. Like, yeah. You can just buy a new one. It's cheaper to buy a new faucet than it is to repair an yeah. old piece of crap. You I don't know. Like that. Anyways, you're all set here. Let's go look at that toilet, my friend. Oh, you're gonna do that. Well, he asked about it. Let's go check it out. Oh, I got that. I got it. Hey, pumpkin. Smashing pumpkins. 
Hang it, don't, don't do it too hard. It just rocks a little bit. Yeah, when you get up, you can hear it hit. Before. All right, I'll just put Thank a shim in it. Thank you. All right, guys, so the homeowner was complaining about this toilet rocking, and you can see that it wasn't shimmed. And uh, he's probably gonna get get some of those cola toilets from Lowe's and I'll uh, put them in for him. But in the meantime, I just stuck some, I shimmed the side and the front and it's not rocking anymore. Uh, and I'm just gonna put some caulk in there and, and he calls me to get it done. Yeah, that, that, that handle sticks every now and then for whatever reason. I don't know what the hell's wrong with it. It seems loose. Yeah, I, I don't know what the hell. It may be bad. I mean, I, I got new handles, so... I can smell bleach in this. Yeah, I, I You got those chlorine tablets? No. Okay, don't use them because... No, I they, spray bleach in there. Okay, because it destroys the uh, plastic parts in the rubber on your flapper if you put it in the tank. Yeah. All that shit that says, you know, it's No, safe. I don't put anything in that, in that tank. Don't trust them anyway. We got a we got a drip coming off of this closet, this tank of bolt. So I'm going to tighten that up. 